Hi, you guys. There we go. <laughs> okay, guys. So we are filming. If you couldn't guess, carving pumpkin. Oh. But we also got a post out saying to asking to send questions in that you want to know. Uh, so we're I'm doing Q and A Q and A while we carve pumpkins. Yeah. Um. And our pumpkins is a baby and a mummy. Yes, first things first, you've got to draw what you've got to do. No, you don't. don't you? Yeah, and then no, you, you have to cut the top of them and get oh, the seeds out. Yeah. So we have our little food waste bowl and we've got all our tools here. This is sharp, so don't use at home without parent supervision. First question is, are you enjoying vlogging? Jamie, you can start. Um, yeah. It's, um, Ow. gets... Jamie, that's quite dangerous. What? Using that, use one of these. No, it gets a bit difficult at times because I'm working four days a week, but kind of finds it, find it difficult to find the time to actually film some videos. However, Ow, I am enjoying it. Me too. Well, when, when we can, we find the content to film. I enjoy it. It is really fun though, I like it because I can. <laughs> oh, that's. You're so... an idiot. She's done it so small. Oh, now my thing's not even gonna fit, is it? Idiot! I didn't think about that. Do you know what you could do? You could turn it. You could put that back in. Yeah. And then turn it upside down and cut the bottom out, and then slide okay. it on top of the candle. Yeah. Gosh. An idiot. I like vlogging because I can talk rubbish for ages. We should but... have a podcast one day. Yeah, I like it. It's fun. Also, I love editing the videos. Oh, bro I like Brooke editing the videos because that means I get my own time playing f Xbox. Oh, I've done it too small again. The next question is, how is your alphabet dating going? Charlie Bates, how is your alphabet dating going? Well, we've only done one video of it because it's quite hard to think of what to do, isn't it? <laughs> uh, yeah. Have you even see yet? No. See, it could be carnival. Oh, yeah. Oh, actually, it's all coming out the bottom now. But, yeah, it's quite hard to think of what to do, and also we haven't got around to filming it. We were going to do it today, weren't we? But then we did carbon pumpkins instead. Yeah. Okay, next question is, any holidays planned? Nope. Well, I said to Jamie earlier that he has no choice and we're going to New York for Christmas next year. Oh, I don't care if he doesn't want to, because we are. Um, quite expensive, but it's all right. But we have no... No planned holidays because Jamie doesn't have a passport at the moment. I don't have a passport at the moment. I'm working like 48 hours a week in Christmas, so I'm just gonna save my holiday for the new year and then probably go away and get my passport done through December. Are you ready for your driving test, Brooke? Um, no, it's meant to be on the 3rd of November, but I had a driving lesson last week. He said I'm not ready, which I knew anyway, like. He said I am, I just need to be more confident and stuff. So he's going to try change it, my driving instructor is going to try change it for like late November instead of like the start of it. So then hopefully I'll be ready. But I'm not very confident in making my own decisions like at junctions and roundabouts and stuff. Is marriage on the cards for you too? Not right now. <laughs> okay. Jamie says he's going to propose to Taylor Swift, but I don't know. No, I to. don't. You said that I didn't times. say that at all. I said people were saying that. No, and you said it, so don't lie. No, I did yes, not. I think you've put that in your head, darling. I have not Jamie, said, you've that. said it. I have not like said three that. Three times to me. I genuinely haven't said that. You have. I've. So I've told you no. No oh, thanks. <laughs> Great. So there's your answer. No. <laughs> I do want you to. Not a Taylor Swift though. I want to be looking at her. Oh. Not on the ground. Like I know, I know exactly where I want to do it. If if I ever do. Want to marry me? If you uh, ever want to marry me, bloody cheek. I know that you do. What? You want to marry me. How do you know I want to marry you? You've said that to me a million times. You've said it more to me. No, you've said it more <laughs> oh, to me. Oh, come on now. I know where you're doing around. it anyway. Where? Cornwall. You are. No, I'm not. You are. Where I lost my ring. I need to wash my hands quickly. Jimmy, you can do the next question. This video is just turned into an argument. Where do you see yourself in five years? Content creation, or like personal training, or like 
personal training on social media and that's so like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Oh, and... How old will we be? Um, I'll be 22. Will I be 22? 18. I'll be 23. My pumpkin is all out now. My pumpkin! Pumpkin! I see myself... Mine's got like slime in it, like this. Hopefully I have a house. Do I have to get all this out? Yeah. I want to have a house. Oh yeah. And... You'll probably have that by next year. Mmm, hopefully rich. Hopefully with a Chanel bag or something. That's my so goal. All she wants is bags no, these days. No, I told myself that's my goal. I want to... That's what you want to buy. Well, only when I can really afford it. Get one from JD for cheaper. What a rucksack. Yeah. A peony bag. Yeah. Like this in my pumpkin. That's uh, how pumpkins are. Do I have to get it all out? Yeah. How the hell am I getting all that out? By using this, probably not this great bloody thing. Do I need to do some? Yes, please. Okay, find the next question then. Okay, well, I'll, oh yeah, I see myself for you is with a house. A kitty cat, a kitty a cat. A kitty cat. <laughs> and engaged to Brock, hopefully. Hopefully, you just said you don't want to marry me. I do, I do. See, he does. Do. I do. <laughs> see, he does. I do. Hopefully, 10,000 subscribers. Or more. Well, we'll probably get more than 10,000 in five years. Hopefully, I hope so. Anyway, <laughs> don't jinx it. Just want to just go in butt in and say, I'm really glad we've reviewed their kids. <laughs> oh, yeah, maybe it'll be in my tummy. I don't know. <laughs> Where are we both spending Christmas this year? So, normally, it's I'm here on Christmas Day, Brooks at hers, and then we meet up on Boxing Day and do presents. Mm -hmm. Normally, at my house because you normally have Christmas Day on Boxing Day, don't you? Yeah, but his dad normally works Christmas Day. But this year. Depends if I'm driving or not. This bad one because Brooke doesn't want me to, but Tom and Tom got a really big game on Boxing Day. And I haven't told her yet. But You have told me a million no, times. Yeah, but I no. said if you go you're getting no presents. If, I've booked the coach ticket. No you haven't. <laughs> They're not out yet. No, they are. Okay, well no presents for you then, it seems. Um but you said the other day I could go. That's the thing. Yeah, I think you're dead. Oh, I think you're dead. Oh, you're dead. Sorry. Next question. We just had to stop filming because the gas man was there. The gas man and my nan and Reese and Bella all came in the kitchen. But I think we were on about if we wanted to go to university. The question was are you and Brooke interested in going to university? Uh uh. No, I hate. Like school, I don't. I did enjoy school, but for the social side, not for the learning side. And I just don't know what I'm gonna do. So nothing interests me about going uni. So I, won't I go. think it would be fun for the social side, but I don't really want to be in education again. I'd rather work full time, get the money, and then do my personal training course. Yeah, I'd rather be working. And also then grow our media. I'm gonna be drawing my kitty cat. Do you need a pen? Oh well, I've got that pen for me, but Sorry. that's fine, we can share it. Okay. Uh, so the next question is, do you pay rent, Jamie, when you, as you're working more hours? And the answer is yes. I used to work 16 hours a week at Sainsbury's, um, so part-time, and mum didn't charge me rent, uh, but she just made sure I put £250 into savings every month that I got. But now I'm on a full-time contract, I pay and do my own savings. <laughs> I'm scared. You're scared. I tried to do eyeliner on my cat. Oh, well, I'm terrified. Right. I'm rubbing that off. This question okay. is, what was the last compliment you received? So, my last compliment. <laughs> I always get a compliment when I wake up from Brooke. You're so cute. <laughs> that, so that's the last compliment I received. Mine was um, about an hour ago. Jamie said I look pretty and I said, no, I don't. And then he said, Yes, you do. I said, if I tell you you're pretty, that means you're pretty, silly girl. Because I just got out of the shower and I looked like a bit of a rat. Yes, that was my last compliment. Um, Next question. Is there one job you'd never do? That one? Um, yes. Maybe a bin man. I would like to be a bin man. Would I you? wouldn't mind being a bin man. Wouldn't want to be a sewage man. Oh, yeah. Like, you know, the drains and that. Yeah, like, imagine getting poo on you. Next question. 
What was the last thing to make you cry? Uh, the last thing that made me cry was basically me and Brooke were play fighting and she went like that and her ring caught me in the eye and I cried <laughs> because it hurt a lot. Yeah, that was sad. But that wasn't like, she didn't mean to. <laughs> she was just like, go away and the ring caught me right in the eye and oh, it hurts so bad. Yeah. You don't really cry to be honest, do you? <laughs> well, Brooke, you need to say something, darling. No, I was just avoiding it. Let's quit. Um, what habits do you find disgusting? I think habits. that means of each other. I find Jane. I could really expose you right now, James. Should I or not? About what? About your disgusting habits. No. I could. That's really not bad. Exposed, no. Okay. I'll just say. He has to be strongly encouraged to get in the shower. No, I don't! Brother, yes you do. I've had two baths this week. So that's Jamie's disgusting habit. He does clean, but he just needs to be strongly encouraged to. What's mine? Oh, that was good. Oh, you don't actually have many, do you? No, I'm pretty perfect. Oh, I've done it all wrong. I've done it all wrong. <laughs> what is that? Shush! Show them your no, eye. No, wait, wait, no, wait. No, them. because I've ruined it! <laughs> Look, that's my eye. I was meant to not cut that, oh. I was meant to do that. That's pretty bad to be honest, that's just a circle. Look at mine. What the heck? Okay, next question. Lip sake. Infinite money or undying love? Uh, I would rather <laughs> infinite money. I don't know what undying love means, go on, so. Like infinite love, like, like undying love, like the love will never die. So like me and you. Ah, uh, but we already know it's never going to die, so... Not my pen. I'd rather undying Bro, love. Can I have my pen? Can you let me answer the question? I'd rather undying love because if you have infinite money, you're just gonna get bored of that money, aren't you? Like once you've got what you want, then what else are you gonna do? But you could help I want... you could help the world. I want the pen. If you have infinite money, you can give everyone <laughs> money in the world and then world problems will be solved. So maybe infinite money can help the world. Why are you not giving me my pen? I'm answering my question. <laughs> Give me the pen. Jamie, I'm not You don't question. need the pen to answer. If I do, I flick it around. Well, some of you aren't good at but wish you were. Uh, Singing. Singing is my passion. <laughs> I'm joking. Also, the guitar. I am quite good at the guitar, but I just kind of gave up. What about you, Jamie? Football. Football. Because I get paid a lot. You are quite good at football, but you just don't play, do you? Nope. This is my Kit Kat. <laughs> it's terrifying. <laughs> Um, what did you buy yourself with your first pay packet? I actually brought a pair of Air Forces, £110, and I came home with them and Mum was like, what? Why have you brought them? I remember watching the vlog. But it's because never really used to have nice, like, I had shoes in that, but not like designer nice blingy ones, so I thought, take advantage of that. I can't remember what I brought. I'm gonna say clothes because I really can't remember and it probably was clothes. The first job was when I was 15, I was a pot wash in a pub. That's why I can't remember and it really wasn't a lot, it was probably like 200 pounds. Um, but obviously, because I was 15, I probably thought that was, well, I did think that was a lot. But, it was a lot for a 15 year old to be fair. Yeah, but I can't remember what I bought. I think probably the clothes. Brought that and then probably brought a babe. <laughs> No. <laughs> What's the most embarrassing thing you've done in public? Right. So, you know when you're like 15 or 14 and you go into town with your friends, like really fun and like such a big deal. Well, me and my friend I don't know where this is going. were um, waiting to be picked up by our other friend. I've done it again! If our other friend to pick us up and we weren't really sure what her car looked like. But anyway, we were stood oh. on the side of the road waiting, and I was like, oh, that's a car, that's a car. So we started waving at it. Obviously, it pulled over. It was probably like, what do these girls want? And without thinking, I opened the car door, jumped inside, went to my friend, come on quickly, because obviously she stopped on the main road. This lady went, oh, what are you doing? I looked up, and this random woman. I just jumped in her car, and I'm like to my friend, get in. I was absolutely mortified. Obviously, I jumped out of the car. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. But she was really angry, so she just sped up. I didn't get a chance to be like, I thought you were my friend. So that was really embarrassing. What about you, Jamie? I would say, probably falling off my bike. Yes, I made it halfway down my road before. 
on my bike, went up a curb, fell off, and this uh, I had to be driven from the end of the road to the top of the road with my bike broken because I really hurt my foot Aww. and I was crying and everything. Oh my gosh. Yeah, what's the next Slay question? Cat. Slay cat. Purr. Okay, this is... The okay. last question. This is the last question because it's just the last question. Oh. oh, no, there is one more. Do you get on with my family as much as I get on with yours? How do you do it? He doesn't want to talk right now. He's a bit stressed. We're about the same, aren't we? Yeah, my siblings love him. Well, except Sandy. <laughs> Sandy, if you're watching this, me and Except well. once I've really scared your sister. Oh Jamie. yeah, Jamie does this thing. Do you want to demonstrate or not? Mm. Yeah, that's good. Oh, mm. yeah. <laughs> he was doing that in her face and she's like, she was two at the time, I think, or three. She was absolutely terrified, going, no, Jamie, stop, stop. And he just kept doing it, and it really scared her. Okay, this is the last question now. What motivates you? Jamie, you can go first. So, my motivation is negativity. So, like, if someone tells me, like, I'm something, like, that looks good to be fair. Someone, <laughs> like, says, you're so big-headed and you're so about yourself and, like, self-centered, I like that. Because then it motivates me. Yeah, but being self-centered isn't a good thing. No, like, not, but they say it to try and get under my skin. Oh, right. And I use that to motivate me. I use that to boost myself to be better than them. Because obviously, if they're saying negative comments about me, then they're obviously not happy with themselves because they're taking the time out of the day to be negative. They made an account called Jamie Can't Drive. I was like, why do we think I can't drive people? Um, so I just use all the bad comments about me. My motivation is um, jewellery, clothes, like, I'll, like, I really want this necklace from Tiffany. Oh my home. gosh. It's the cutest thing in the freaking world. And like, if I want to go to work, I'll just look at that and be like, well, if you want that, you have to go to work. And also, my motivation is I really want to get a Chanel bag in five years. Like, not just get a Chanel bag, like, be able to afford it and not have to, like, not, like, you know, like, be able to actually afford one instead of, like, using all my money for it, you know? Like, so that's my motivation. Just nice things. My motivation is and Taylor Swift. FIFA. Taylor Swift. I think Taylor Swift, I could go on about how great she is and how motivational she is. I won't because that will be a really long video. But anyway, I didn't be. What do you think? Be for broke. I've done mine. Be for bum. Be for boo. Be for boo basket. That's mine done. Yours says spoo. Spoo and TTFC on That's the fucking side. bad. Not gonna. <laughs> this is the worst pumpkin I've ever seen in my life. Not even gonna lie. I just paid 99p for this, thrown it down the drain. What is that? <laughs> Mike for Skowski. <laughs> It's a rubbish cat. So, is that the end of the video? Yeah. Sorry, I had a haircut. Okay. Alright, so let's show them the finished product. So mine was meant to be Mike Fuskowski thing. So I was meant to do an eye there and keep it there. So show them your, them your Yeah, but I kept accidentally cutting where I wasn't meant to, so I was going to keep teeth there as well. It looks exactly the same. And then I put... Was writing spooky on the side and gave up. <laughs> and then I've engraved TTSC on the side. But that's my pumpkin. Hope you like it, guys. I hate oh, it. Mine is a little cat. I tried to give the cat eyeliner. Obviously, Brooke's gonna win. And um, I wasn't really sure how. To, but this is it. It's meant to be a cat, and then I did a bee. So, guys, go comment down below whose pumpkin is better. Exhibit A, Mike Fuskowski, Jamie's pumpkin, or, or a exhibit hole in B, a pumpkin. It's not a hole in a pumpkin. Or kitty cat. Or kitty cat for Brooke. Thank you guys for watching. I hope we answered all your questions that you had to ask and learn so something. So if it was a bit chaotic and all over the place as well. Yeah, we hopefully you've learned something new about us today. Like Brooke wants me to propose to her to her. Actually. I didn't say that. Okay, okay, okay. Said I told you not to. Thank you guys for watching. Um, and we'll see you in the next video.
uh, which is on. Oh my gosh, next week's video is so freaking fun. Make me each other boo baskets. Yay! Yay! I have been bugged for since the start of October to make her a boo basket. So I said, you know what? Yes. And I'm going to make him one as well because there's loads of cute things I want to give you. <laughs> uh, so that's going to be a good video. And Saturday, carnival. So we'll probably vlog. Yay! It's going to be so bad. It's not. You will love it. No, I'm not. I don't want to watch floats go around. <laughs> oh, I love carnival. <laughs> I don't want to watch the floats go along the road when it's freezing cold outside. Tough to be luck, honest. Then, I, I don't suppose. want to do that at all. Tough. Thank you for watching. And we'll see you on... Then let's look. Bye.